Okay, YouTube family, let's talk about it. It's your favorite girl. I'm about to do round two of the Q&A. Hopefully in this goddamn live, we'll hear the cash registers or something going. Let's go ahead and get into this part two of the Q&A. Y'all girl, definitely not my girl. Big Red! So she starts off the video in a goddamn do-rag. Girl, you in these people goddamn classy boutique store with a damn do-rag on your head, ma'am? It is giving you just got up and just roll out the bed. That's what it's giving, ma'am. Ma'am, we need effort when you coming in the goddamn store, okay? If I'm gonna come in that store, if I, if I open up the store to come spend my hard-earned money and I come in the door and you in the do-rag, I'm turning around. I don't want nothing out the damn store child somebody asked her do she miss indiana and she said yes she said although it's a lot of food spots in vegas none of it tastes like indiana yes i miss it i miss my family i miss the um the club i miss my friends girl she's saying all that to let you guys know she's preparing you guys for the video that's gonna follow later down the line that i'm going back to gary it's because I miss my family. That's what that's about. Girl, nobody shouldn't have been asked you that question anyway. You only been there, what, three weeks? Child, somebody asked her, did you meet Ari? Y'all know damn well. Now, who who asked that question? Because you're trying to be funny. That must be from our side that asked that question. Y'all know damn well she didn't meet no Ari, okay? As much as she posts Ari on her Insta stories, baby, if she met Ari, the pictures would have been there so y'all know that she did not meet Ari but then she trying to pull BM in to explain the reason why girl bye and then she going to talk about and it's not because of nobody was hosting or nothing had nothing to do with that girl bye you know you wasn't going CJ lied to your ass allegedly you know damn well he was not about to put you in it's what he said 20 grand 30 grand VIP section he lied it was for the views and the clicks he was not going to do that for you ma'am okay alright child so she's trying to say the reason why they didn't go see Ari because they had some people come in to Vegas and they went to brunch and they was drinking and BM got sick and was throwing up on the side of the road. That's the reason why they ain't went. Girl, baby, girl, stop. Once you throw up, you feel better. So it was no excuse. She could have went home, brushed her teeth, got in the shower, and got dressed and went to go see Ari. Let's see the tickets. Let's see the tickets for the VIP section that y'all purchased. Let's see the tickets, ma'am. We don't want to see no videos of her leaning over outside of the damn car. We don't care about the dates. We don't care about nothing. Show us the tickets that y'all purchased from that night, ma'am. All right. Child. So somebody asked her about the house tour. Because, you know, people been waiting on a house tour for damn near a month. Okay? Because, ma'am, first of all, you already had showed the outside of the townhome. And you already showed the inside. So what's the problem with doing the house tour? Her excuse is, well, people been around here putting out fake addresses saying that this is our address and it's not. So because people is doing that... I don't want to do a house tour. So if it's a fake address, ma'am, why does it matter if you do a house tour? Let's talk about where you really live, ma'am. Because you know, word on the streets, allegedly, that those are goddamn rented Airbnbs. I even heard in the streets that you might be living in CJO house now i already had said that some videos back i would have to find out which video that was but i already said that's where she was going to be living because think about it when cj moved in that damn house royalty made a video saying that she that he moved five minutes away and that's the same house he claimed that he had to hurry up and move out of because his address was leaked i think that's the same uh town home big red is in that's why they can't do a a house tour not to mention sis didn't you show us uh didn't you give us a house tour of that house of yours with those old ass doors those old ass cabinet doors some oak doors that tasha can say ma'am no ma'am your your baby daddy is a millionaire ma'am you shouldn't be having doors like that it's time to level you up <laughs> the shade 
and that goddamn interview was hilarious. Now, I'm going to say this. This is what I think, okay? I think when y'all saw the video of Big Red moving her stuff out that house, I honestly believe she's moving out that house in Indiana. But I do think she's going to get another apartment or house in Indiana. I think she only came down to Vegas to, you know, make sure her daughter get enrolled in school, you know, just for the first few months, just to make sure everything goes off well. And I think she's going back to Indiana, but I don't think she's going back to that house. I could be wrong. Drop down in the comments. Comments are open for discussion. What y'all think about what I just said? Child, she said she wanted to address the issue about people speaking on her daughter. Talk about her daughter is too big to be in sixth grade. Her daddy is six three. His mama is five nine. What y'all expect? Girl, it, let me tell you something. It's not about height. It's about how your daughter carry on in the YouTube streets. It's how she carry on in, in, on Instagram. They're not saying that she's too tall for her age. They're saying the way that she act is grown. They say that the normal average 11 year old do not act like that, ma'am. And I know you know that's what they're saying, but you're trying to make it into something else. Child, this is funny. She talk about for all that grown people that be talking on my daughter. This is why I don't want to post my kids. Girl, bye. Don't try to use that as an excuse for why your son is missing. Ma'am, we still want to know where is your son, ma'am? Child, she's talking about y'all picking on my daughter because she in them line like, girl, this is just YouTube, ma'am. This is not BET. This is not USA. This is not Bravo. This is not A&E. You know, this is not no major networks for you to be saying it like that. <laughs> is you trying to say your daughter is famous? Girl, drop down in the comments. <laughs> is, is Big Red daughter famous? Okay. Child, I guess this video is about her daughter because she's still speaking on her daughter. Talk about all the grown, miserable people out there. Girl, ain't nobody miserable but your ass. You the only one that's give miserable okay instead of you again talking to your daughter about her actions in the youtube streets in the instagram streets you get on here and you defend her all over again yeah that's your child you know I, i'm a mother as well but i will let my girls know when they're wrong okay i'm not gonna get on here and and, and try to attack you know people who have opinions about my child I, I wouldn't care. If it's not true, why would I care? Obviously, it's true because you're getting on here bothered. You only could be bothered when it's true, right? Oh, okay. Child, she talk about I would love to run in the streets with some of you fat bottom of the barrels. Hold up, ma'am. Is you calling somebody F-A-T? Did you look in the mirror, ma'am? <laughs> Word on the streets, they say your BBL is botch. It said you didn't get a BBL, you got an LBB. <laughs> That's what they saying, ma'am. Ma'am, they saying your upper body is big as hell. They say they say you like a Ninja Turtle. I'm like, nah, they got to stop talking about being red. Like, That's what they saying in the streets, ma'am. So, <laughs> you can't be calling nobody FAT, ma'am. You got to look in the mirror at yourself. You... Make sure you you right before you, you start going off, okay? All right. Child, sis, y'all keep speaking on me and TV relationship. I do not have to be affectionate on YouTube. Girl, yes, you do. Because you can't keep your goddamn hands off, CJ. You're always figuring out a way to touch him. So you're very, uh, very affectionate with your baby daddy, but not your BM. But she talk about... Tavy ain't going nowhere. We done been together three years. And I'm trying to figure out how you been together three years and her daughter four. Child, what kind of menage twat shit going on here? Because her son two years old. So if BM daughter is four, they been together three years and her son is two. Oh shit, y'all drop down to the comments. Who peeped that shit out? Child. Somebody asked her, do you have any plans 
for your birthday. She said, yes, I'm going back home. Girl, cause <laughs> girl, she thought CJ was gonna throw her a party like royalty. Girl, you could keep wishing that was not gonna happen. She's like, so yeah, they they got their eyes open, ready for me to come back. Girl, you acting like you done been gone for a year or two, and you haven't seen your family in a year or two. Girl, you just been there. You just went there where you had to take your son back, ma'am. <laughs> Child, this is a joke. <laughs> Y'all drop down to the comments. Big Red says she going back to Indiana to goddamn do her party. Girl, she ain't going to have no party, girl. And then she around here putting something out, talking about come pull up on her. Girl, nobody want to pull up with you, especially if you going to pull up with them damn shades and that damn red hair like you did last night. Girl, I'm like, what the hell is going on? <laughs> Y'all understand this be for entertainment purposes, y'all. When I be doing my reactions, trust me, I'm gonna make you laugh. Okay, you gonna laugh. This is all for jokes. This is just this fun. This is fun. You know, I'm doing my reactions a little different than how other people do theirs. Also, I saw where somebody in the comments said that I should start putting the videos or doing clips. Hell no, I'm not putting those people content in mine. I see other people be doing it. I don't trust it. You know, I be talking shit. So, I wouldn't feel comfortable putting their videos in my content. So, they can try to, no, that's okay. No, no, no. That's why I tell you guys the name of the video that I'm going to do a reaction to. So, you can go back and watch it. Or you can pull it up and listen to me at the same time while I'm doing my reaction. But no, I'm not going to, I don't feel comfortable putting their content in my content when I'm talking shit about the ass. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. Child, somebody ask her uh, why they don't like you. Why they be hating on you so hard. And she talk about, I, I bet you if you ask them that, they don't even know. You know, they had to pick a side and be on a bandwagon that's what you did didn't you pick a side didn't you choose baby Zaddy? you never met royalty in real life you never met her just the same shit you saying you said that people don't like you and they don't even know you and you didn't like her you don't even know her allegedly but then you pick a side so so you saying a bunch of nothing a bunch of nothing next question child i know she did not just say that you don't like being lied to. Girl, your baby daddy lie all the time, ma'am, allegedly. So what you mean you don't like to be lied to? Girl, you don't like fake stuff. What? Girl, what you mean you don't like fake stuff? <laughs> Are you seeing what we seeing, ma'am? It's fake. You want us to think what's going on up there in, in Henderson is real, ma'am? It's a skit. It's a big old ass skit, right? Child, she sounds... Let me shut up. Child, I know damn well this girl didn't say she don't like a weak-minded person. Ma'am, I'm sorry to have to tell you this. You are a weak-minded person. I'm going to say allegedly, but we already know. very You are very weak-minded, okay? And you are easily to be manipulated, Okay? And the fact that you're sitting here and recording this video and saying the things that you're saying is sad. It's sad as hell. I don't know you, but I voice my opinions off based, based off your actions. So if I'm reacting to your content, I'm reacting to what I'm seeing, ma'am. But you are very easily to be manipulated and you have been manipulated. The simple fact that you was able to record a video that you're moving and all of that stuff. You pick up your furniture, your life to go. Well, no, not the furniture. <laughs> but you picked up your life to go move to Vegas behind a man that's not yours, baby. You had to be manipulated. There is no other way that anybody can make sense of this shit. Who in the hell would do that? That's not your husband. That's not even your boyfriend that you've been in a serious relationship with. It's not even your fiance. He's nothing but your baby daddy. And you decided to pick up, you you decided to put on this persona that you moved to Vegas for business. But you sitting in a goddamn hair store. Where's the business deals, ma'am? So that's the business for you to come down and sit in the store while G Money and his wife and, and CJ doing whatever they want to go do by while you sitting in the hair store. I don't I don't see what she's doing any differently up there in Vegas. I don't see it. Other than sitting in the goddamn hair store making QA start in trouble. That's what it's giving. Not to mention, ah, 
Y'all can pull up on me. We gonna run into each other, girl. Stop thinking you bad, ma'am. I already did the rundown on yesterday. You know, that video with you and Rusty, baby, you was tired. <laughs> You was tired, ma'am. And then the other video that's floating in YouTube streets where you was getting dragged, the girl was dragging you by your ponytail, ma'am. So it's not giving what you say is giving. Child, towards the end of the video, she said, well, if I didn't have haters, that means I wouldn't be doing right. Girl, you don't have no haters. Nobody's hating on you, ma'am. You're being called out for the BS. That's what it is. Nobody's hating. Everything people are saying in the YouTube streets, from what I'm seeing, based off the content you're putting out, ma'am, holds truth to it. So I wouldn't say that's hating, ma'am. So, y'all, I'm done. <sighs> child this video was all over the goddamn place she spent most of the video speaking on her goddamn daughter and defending her daughter child please don't do no more goddamn q a's okay nobody wants to know nothing else you keep encouraging people to ask you questions nobody want to ask you nothing you're not beyonce you're not oprah you know you're not diddy you're not bill gates you know you're not somebody out there with some real influence to be asking questions to use you only known because your baby daddy is cj that's it ma'am nobody wants to ask you nothing okay what can you tell us you don't know much about cj <laughs> but anywho until the next video